Okay, here we have a dresser that is made out of laminated wood. And we're going to try and refinish this dresser by using contact paper. And the contact paper that we chose is this beautiful zebra print. So I purchased this at Walmart and it was only $5 and change. So we're going to try to use this to cover this. So we'll see how it goes and we'll let you know. Okay, the first step is to remove the handles. So remove each and every handle from the dresser. Okay, so we just laid the adhesive paper over the drawer, cut it to length or width. Nice. Now you're just removing the excess with the razor. No, I don't think you can do a corner without slicing it. Okay. Okay, now we are working on laminating the top of the dresser. We cut a piece. All of the drawers are done, as you can see. And I'll be back. Okay, the top is finished. This is how it came out. We're going to work on the sides now. That's next. Okay, we laid the dresser on its side, as you can see, and cut a piece that long. We're going to place it on and be right back. Okay, this side is completely finished, as you can see. We just cut it up there, down there, just tuck that in over here. And we're going to work on the other side, so just redo the same thing that you did on this side, on the other side. Okay, the dresser is complete. We have finished laminating it. This is what it looks like to so the top and the sides. And of course we did the bottom, which I didn't video. 
very bottom right there. And I'm going to spray paint the handles, so I guess stay tuned if you want to see that. And I'll show you what it looks like after those are put back on. So this is what it looks like right now. Okay, so here's the handles. I'm using a stump outside, so don't mind the mess. And I'm going to spray paint them over here. I am using this Rust-Oleum Ultra Cover, which has two times the coverage in a white gloss and this stuff is really good so I highly recommend this you can pick this up anywhere I picked this up at Walmart and it was only like three dollars and change I believe or maybe even less so it's very affordable so I'm just gonna go ahead and spray paint them and show you how it looks after I'm done be right back okay I'm done spray painting them but we're having an issue right there on the knobs the white paint is not sticking to the part that's like the wood so, either it has grease from oil, from hands, or I just got to replace those. So, I'm just going to go ahead and let these other handles dry. These are just for the bottom drawer. So, maybe I could replace those. It's not a big deal if I just get white ones. But, these at least took. Even the wood on these pieces took. So, I assume maybe it's from hands, I don't know, from those knobs. So, yeah, so... I guess I'll update you on what I'm going to do about these knobs. But right now I'm going to let these dry. So I'll see you later. Okay, so these knobs actually worked out. I was able to get them painted. All, all we had to do was uh, layer it on. So just put another coat, let it dry, and then do it like two more times. So it took, finally. So that's what it looks like. And this is how the dresser came out with the handles on it. So now it's finished. As you can see, it looks really, really nice. If you have any questions for me, please let me know in the comments down below. I hope you enjoyed this video tutorial. Have a great day. Bye.